everybody, welcome back to here playing another game of League of Legends. I'm the Strategy Professor, doing old Tom Kinch today. Now, this isn't a perfect comp for Tom Kinch, but I really wanted to sneak a Tom Kinch game in there because I haven't had one in a little while, and I know we have Tom Kinch fans out there. Uh, I kind of... Uh, I should have done Janna here, honestly. There's a, a sub that really wanted me to play some Janna, and I'm going to try to get it in next game, but... Tom Kinch is just, frankly, he's really hard to squeeze into the current meta, at least at Diamond, because people just don't play those champions like Leona, Morgana, that stuff, because they know that they're not as strong as other options. Like, as sad as I hate to say it, you know, they've kind of figured it out in Diamond. Oh, they're scared. Look how scared they are. Or they're baiting us. Well, they know we're going to hit level 2 first, so... I'm not walking up close enough to get hit under tower, and I need to get a ward right here. So we don't get, like, level level 3 cheesed. Also, champions that he, like, Jinx and Jin that he was really good with, people just aren't playing those as much either. So he's taken quite a few hits on multiple fronts, although I do think... If Ash comes back, which is possible that he will come back. A lot of Tom Kench's power. Um, now, Tom Kench, or if Nautilus stays really strong, Tom Kench is very good against Nautilus. Or if Thresh comes back. Like, there's a few champions that he just totally hoses. He's a very meta dependent kind of champion. Oops, that's probably bad. It's fine. I should not have put her in the middle of that wave. Should have had multiple uh, potions chug in there. Mm, I feel like we could have killed him there. I don't know. I didn't want to use my flash. If I could have flash stunned Alistar, I don't know. It was dicey. Okay, no one else would have saved her right Oh, what the f- Are you kidding me, bro? Took me a second. It's really hard for me to say that, but I mean, I've messed up mechanical stuff too. That's not mechanical though. That's just straight up like leave. You have no health. But I mean, he knows. He knows he goofed up. There's no point in berating him about it. He knows. It's just frustrating because we just—I just outplayed that so hard. People aren't at a position like as much in Diamond, also, in general. Whereas that's where Tom Kench really comes in in the mid game, where people are just constantly out of position. It doesn't happen as much in Diamond. People still are out of position, but not to the same degree, usually. Well, 
Where is Rek'Sai? She's gotta be top, or maybe she's on the other side of middle, I don't know. Okay, I got him. Now later on in the game, if I was to start combo somebody, then I can definitely take him down. Hmm. It's not good. Where is this guy? Like, where is Rek'Sai? A little bit worried. I don't have flash for like. Okay, he's back. We haven't seen Rexai in a very long time. I'm kind of worried. They're acting weird. See, so Ezreal's starting to get more position more aggressively. I think he's here. Or she is. Like, it's just so suspicious. She didn't show up mid. She didn't show up top. Like, what is she doing? She's got to be here, right? Yeah, they're trying to force it so hard. She's got to be around here. Yeah, like, where is he? Okay, they just lost their mind and decided to go crazy. I don't know. Maybe because they hit level 6 first, they just decided that was what they wanted to do. I thought Rek'Sai was there for sure. Uh, okay, they don't actually have a teleport, so that's one thing we don't have to worry about, so that's good. Really? You're taking exhaust? No, you took ignite, okay. I mean, what the hell are, like, his team doing? Like, Lee Sin, get down here. I mean, that's twice now. Now, he's had two five-minute windows to show up bottom and kill that Alistar anytime he wants. Like, I'm not one of those people that's constantly like, jungler, please gank me. But it's like, if it's an Alistar and he doesn't have his flash, and I can warp behind him as Tom Kench, like, it's so easy. It's uh, a lot of map mismanagement. I mean, he is making plays, he is making stuff happen in other lanes, but they just got a tower.
We don't have enough people here. We don't have enough people here, man. You got him, coach. Get this. I mean, Alistar can break out of it with his ult, but he's still going to take, you know, whatever, 20% of his max health. I think that's before the ult triggers, too. Not 100% about that. Got him. Nautilus is 100% about to die to tower there. I did not get a haircut. My hair, I just washed it. <laughs> it just doesn't look like complete garbage. I mean, anyone that's had long hair before knows that your hair can look really terrible if you don't keep up with it. And I just, yesterday, or sometimes when you see it just look really bad, it's because I haven't taken a shower in a while. Like, I'd been driving all day. I'd been driving for, like, six hours. And I just came home, like, really late at night and was just going to stream for a couple of hours. Can we beat them? What do we have? What do we have? Uh, we can if... Okay, Lee's here. I think we can get him. I shouldn't have taken that much damage. Oh, God. Okay, that's fine. You need to be careful. Yeah, I'm not going to go looking for him. Now, I want this experience, actually. And then I'm going to go get that scuttle. Tom Kench is great at not having that scuttler, which is really nice. I mean, not only does it help you rotate faster, but it just gives you extra vision of an area. He's the scuttle king, other than like Ivern with Smite. Okay, everybody's dead, probably top. Nope, I'm out. Who all's here? No, what just killed me? It was like the laser bird, I guess. Wouldn't pay attention. Yeah, it helps a lot with rotations, actually. The uh, the scuttle. And that extra vision is pretty sweet. Uh, I'm trying to get some deep wards in here while everybody's dead. Shut out all those tunnels. Mm, 
Mm, I gotta be careful if he goes on me. God damn it. Well, she's gonna die for it. It's fine, I guess. I wish I could have dodged her little thing. She flashed for it, too. Oh my lord. Get wrecked. That guy just threw his keyboard through the window. I can hear it from here. Some old lady like blocks below with like falling glass like ah. Alright. No true hunger can be abated. Well, I am the four like the four hundred and fiftieth Tom Kinch in the world. I don't even know how those stats are derived. People have told me that from some kind of site that tracks Tom Kinch's, I guess. Oh, who got that ZZ? I love you. Nautilus. This Nautilus is my man here. He needs to take it a step further and go ahead and get uh, Locket or Redemption next. Or another Sight Stone. That's next level. I don't know. This Lee already has basically a Sight Stone. Like, triple Sight Stone would be amazing this game. Just light up the whole dang map. Yeah, they're all rotating over here. They're going to be really, really late. What kind of dragons do we have? No, two wind dragons. Okay, so we're pretty quick. Which one of those is like water or something, but. Come here, boy. No. I can eat him over that wall. If he stands right on the wall, I can eat him. Jeez, I didn't realize that was a quadra. They're all up. I gotta back up a little bit. Let them... Oh no. We're out. They really want something here. That Alistar failed, though. She spit herself out right there on front of him. I was trying to spit her out like, you know, max auto attack range away, but she's like, nah, man, I want to melee that person just for style points. Pretty foolish. Uh, can we, oh, we need this inhibitor. That's right. We didn't, we didn't get it. We need it. I think we can get it. Can't we? Or are people too low? I think we can get it.
Somebody hit it. Holy crap. Get out, get out, get out. Do not sit there and back. We're going to go for the great chase again, it looks like. Yeah, I can't get him out. Nope, time to go. Let me go get this easy. Oh, if you're asking about um, like why I don't upgrade my gold item, I don't want to delay the ZZ rot. Uh, I think I might actually get the ruby here. Like if I buy the ZZ and I just happen to have enough gold to get the ruby so that the first time that I use it, I get that extra cooldown reduction, um, then I'll go ahead and get it. It's like there's not a set time. It depends on the game. Like if I'm just about to have a ZZ off cooldown, then it's really useful. But yeah, you're asking about the health item, why I don't upgrade it. It's not really that much more gold, honestly. It's okay. But it's extra 500 gold that I'd rather spend on a ZZ. Like, to get the ZZ faster. Don't forget the ZZ gives you gold. If it's a really, really hard lane and we need more healing in it, then sometimes I'll get it. But I'm still not convinced that it's worth delaying the ZZ. Or the locket, or the redemption, whatever you choose to get. I think those items are all a little bit better. Oh god, Lee's very low here. I don't know. This might this may have been a mistake. Who's there? Oh, Rek'Sai is there. Okay, we got him though. We got him, coach. This wouldn't be dramatic if there wasn't a 50-50 Baron somewhere in the game. Do we have any heal dragons? We don't. Kate's like way over there. Got him, coach. Uh, yeah, let's. I'm gonna get this. Oh, they gave up. That's no fun. Let me see if this guy wants to play. I'll give him a thumbs up. Teamwork. Yay. A lot of times, you know, a lot of these AD carries will just want to run it solo, and that's fine. I mean, whatever. But it's, you can climb pretty well if uh, you have a duo. I mean, it's it's no secret. 
that the climb is faster if you have a reliable duo. So I try to keep a nice list of reliable duos. Um, Okay, so he's duoed with the Malzahar. Uh, I might get paired with him. Actually, I need to do that quickly. See if I can get paired with him. Or I might potentially be against him. I'm not sure if it's worth the risk. <clears throat> Alright, let me go ahead and just end the VOD there. Thank you very much if you're just watching the VOD. Uh, lots of Tom Kinch on the channel if you're interested. Um, just go check out the videos. I think I have about 50 Tom Kinch VODs out there. Um, so, lots of good content. And uh, I'll see you next time. Have a wonderful evening.